the grave robber highwayman shuffle a rare and wonderful thing all right so do we unlock the boss here nope still have not unlocked the boss we still have to do another mission here to unlock the boss um let's see let's go ahead and let's uh cure these characters of rabies and syphilis there we go is this the last boss yeah i only have the uh one boss left i've killed every boss at this point it's just uh formless flesh is the last one if you had to de-stress after a mission where would you go if i had to de-stress after a mission uh do I have to choose from the stuff here? Probably the Abbey. <laughs> Probably the Abbey. I'm not big for, uh, I'm not big on bars, gambling, tavern, brothel. I'm not big on any of those things. I'd probably be, uh, probably be in one of these. Definitely not whipping myself. Pro probably the cloister, I think, would be where I'd go. I'd go to the Olive Garden. You would go for the gambling book learning and thinking i'd go to the i'd go to the brothel and visit your mom <laughs> you're a degenerate unless you exclusively flagellate i'm describing due to religion well it wouldn't necessarily be a religious thing it would just be i want everybody to get away from me kind of thing <laughs> a little bit different oh i guess we may as well do this for they camp must learn more than brutal bloodletting they must learn to survive uh do all thank you for the 19 months thank you do all yeah i'm a big fan of everybody getting away from me big fan of that uh thank you do all cloud hopper thank you for the resub who's a good boy thank you for the resub thank you very much really appreciate it all right it'd be nice to level up derive functor once more because he's in pretty good shape uh how are you here you're still fully upgraded Crusader's damage is a little bit, uh, a little underwhelming overall. It's, he's he's especially good. I think Holy Lance is what makes him really good, but otherwise, uh, I don't think I really need any new people. Another, another level three man at arms is not the worst, I guess. Imagine getting cured from syphilis, going to the brothel, and getting it again. I, I think a number of my characters have had a, a massive, massive amount of diseases. <laughs> The raw strength of youth may be All right. spent, but his eyes hold the secrets of a hundred. Yeah, we campaigns. should run. We should run double man at arms and set up repost with both of them. Can they both? Can you do double bol bolster? Double bolster. Bolster. Ruins phobe deviant taste is not allowed to visit it. Precise striker. That's pretty nice. That's pretty nice. Double double bolster, double man in arms. That's pretty nice. That'd be a lot of dodge and a lot of reposting. Uh Scruffleophagus, thank you for the seven months. Thank you, Scruffleophagus. All right, I am thinking of a number between uh 100 and 200. Uh first person to guess it gets to be this man in arms. You already have a character, do not guess. It's funny how many people guess the exact same thing. It's really funny. <laughs> oh, I just saw it. I just saw it. We have a winner. Come on down. Mentally inept. You are the next guest on The Price is Right. Mentally inept. There we go. Da, 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 da. We sh I need to get that sound. Ba, 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 na, na. Ba, 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 I should get that. What was it? It was 113. 113. The amount of people guessing 111. <laughs> A lot of people are guessing. Uh, let's see. These characters are good to go. How is Fieldberg? He is good to go. Okay. We have to do another mission. We have to do one more mission in Ruins to level it up once more. It's a medium level three, a short apprentice level one. Can I even, I can't even do a level one. I can't even do it. Even if I wanted to, I can't. Medium veteran level three.
I guess that's not bad. I don't know what bumper... What is bumper crop, anyway? I don't know what that does. Uh, all right. Well, we can stand the level up to Rive Functor a little bit more. We'll bring the Arbalest. Let's go ahead and... Uh, I just lost my healer, right? Because he got syphilis or something. So we'll be without a healer. We could bring Swede Chick along. I feel like that might take it. It might take way too long. All right, let's let's fucking do it. Let's fucking do it. <laughs> Why not? Let's do it. Uh, we'll bring in the double man in arms. They got double rampart, double rampart, double bolster. Why not? And it's a. Is there a short? No, they're all medium. All right. Well, we have the bandages on the man at our, on the, the Arbalester. I don't have, I have, I don't have another healer. I don't have like somebody else I could spare. So I have big badger, but he's uh, got syphilis. I guess syphilis isn't like the worst thing. It's minus accuracy. Minus, yeah, I'm losing the HP definitely hurts. Yeah. Well, I think we'll be okay. I think we'll be okay. Yeah, it probably makes sense to level up Battle Heal on the Crusader. I agree. It does make sense to do that. Not that it's an amazing heal, but... Well, that's your ancestors. Alright, it's a medium level 3 dungeon. Uh, let's take a look here. We'll give you... Uh, let's see. Minus stress. Maybe some more damage might be nice. protection we'll give him some more well that would make his healing worse let's give him the hp that seems fine uh we'll give you the this and the pistol again i suppose we'll give you the pen i don't really care about this like these meme man at arms here Stun resistance, sure, why not? The meme at arms. Debuff resistance, damage versus unholy, cruise bell, 20% healing received. That's not bad, I guess. The meme, it, it, it is rather meme -y. Sure, take that, why not? What difference does it make? All right, here we go. All right, uh, I think we're kitted out here. <laughs> what, are, what are these guys moves? They're both going to be stunning forward too because they both got rampart. <laughs> so stupid. So stupid. All right. Uh, well, I need to do another mission. As long as I succeed the mission, I don't really care. Of a good meme team. All right, this should be good. Uh, shovels, food, torches. All right, let's go. They're gonna have a little shuffle going on. You'll do your best. Yeah, the arbalester and uh, the, the crusader can kind of heal. When it is not eaten. So steal their food. Like how we immediately walked onto a trap. <sighs> I don't leave town without a vessel. I don't have a chance. I don't. Sometimes you have to, dude. You don't always have a choice. How quickly the tide turns! <laughs> a lot of stress, really fast. Arbalest out of position in fight number one. I know, right? You uploaded the prices right in Twitch stuff. How did you get surprised on turn one? That's a great question. It's a great question. Hey, they kind of put me back into position here. All right, well, we've got bolster. Let's bolster again. A lot of bolstering going on. <laughs> The double bolster. This is such this is such a fucking meme. Uh, 
Just bros bolstering it out. The, the bolster. All right, time to set up retribution. set up retribution again <laughs> go ahead like three what if you had this three man at arms all with retribution and then a vestal to heal them <laughs> I do that their formation is broken <laughs> maintain the offensive it's so dumb It's a man at arms race. A brilliant confluence of skill and purpose. Is it dumb if it works? Synchronized shield bashing. Hey, leave him alone, man. He's literally my only goddamn Arbalester. Gotta kill the Arbalester. This game hates my Arbalesters. I don't know why. Wasting sickness. Not sure why this game hates my Arbalesters. Sedated. Continue the onslaught. Bring out only Arbalest with no healer. Game hates my Arbalesters. I've had like three Arbalesters. They've all they've all been like bullied and singled out by the game. Gotta use guard on the Arbalest. I think uh, out of all the characters I've had, I've had die, I've had like zero man at arms die, but I've had like four Arbalesters die. Okay, now if we can actually not be surprised on the literal first fucking room, that'd be great. Wealth beyond measure. Awarded to the All right, let's see what do we got. The so this is a room, curio, curio. Can a curio be? So that's a quest location, quest location. So I guess let's head back to the quest location. It'll say quest item and not curio. Got you. I've just had kind of bad luck with arbalesters. I feel like. I mean, I've had a lot of good luck on a lot of other things, so. I don't even fight. No, 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 I'm not. No, 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 no. We're not. Sorry. Packs laden with loot. I'm not getting baited. I don't have supplies. the right squad for it. I don't have the right squad. Double man in arms. <laughs> If I want to fight the man in arms, I need three ar I need three man in arms and one vestal. <laughs> the ultimate that's the ultimate team. Hi, Georgie. If I haven't assembled the ultimate team. Hello, Georgie. How are what are you doing, meow? It's a lot of bullshit. I really wish this stuff would stack the quest items. I feel like that's kind of bullshit that it doesn't. Sure. The ultimate meme mods. All right, let's set it up. <laughs> uh, we can maybe stun you. Let's try it. Inventory management part of the difficulty. Yeah, I get it. I just feel like everything else stacks, so why wouldn't that stack, you know? Press disadvantage. Give them no quarter. Mm. 
Probably wasn't going to stun him there. Okay. Inventory management is part of the difficulty. Why don't use bandages on knives? Why don't? The victory. Nice job. The turning point. <laughs> These fucking man at arms are funny as shit to me. The light, the promise of safety. Why no bandage knives? Why you know? Gab non. Plus 20 dodge and minus accuracy on. You mean minus 20? Yeah, the suppressing fire is pretty nice. It's pretty nice for sure. Definitely a good move. Uh, pasta socks. Thank you for the five months. Thank you, pasta socks. I love that trigger with the mana and support stations just buffing and guarding. All right, let's go. Come at me, bros. <laughs> Confidence surges as there you the go. Crumbles. Come at me, bra. A decisive pummeling. Are we getting to the final mission? I'm trying to get to the final, the, the boss that I need to do right now is what I'm trying to do. This party composition like actually works pretty well, I think. I mean, I'm not really, I, I feel like it'd be better with three man at arms. Brought low and driven into the mud. It'd be better with three man at arms, but it's pretty good. Four highwaymen. Uh, all right. There we go. Oh, I, I thought it wasn't over. Return to Hamlet. Good. Nice. Our supplies are replenished. What would you do with a million dollars? Three men at arms at once. <laughs> oh, look, a lot of diseases. Look at that. We got rabies. Beast Slayer is a nice move. Uh, I don't know what disease day you got. And Hemophilia. What a quaint little run. A modest offering from those few surrounding farms as yet untouched. By the <laughs> why, why is he doing that voice? <laughs> uh, all right. Let's cure your disease. Uh, it's here. I mean, bleed resist is not the biggest deal, I guess. Wasting sickness, disease resistance. He's already got a disease. What difference does it make? And I think that's it. All right. Those diseases aren't too bad. Feel the Bergs is kind of bad, though. It's something good for you. He dislikes it, I guess so. Oh, look at that. They've got the, uh, is it American Gothic thing right here? The portrait. That's pretty funny. Uh, all right. Let's see. Oh, so we've got the boss, the last boss. That's the foremost flesh plus 50% bleed. Oh, dude, that would have been so good. And darkest dungeon, the bleed resist. That would have been amazing. So much fucking bleed in darkest dungeon. It's ridiculous. That would have been really good. All right. So we've got formless flesh. Um, Let's see. Who do I want to bring for formless flesh? Sort by level. Level five. Uh, do I have a hound master? Oh, I've got Raze. Raze has never been in the darkest dungeon. I mean, should I, I shouldn't be risking characters that can, I don't have, I guess I have a decent number of characters that can go to the darkest dungeon. All right, I'm bringing Orator. 
Bring your orator for sure. Definitely want to bring orator. Uh, Edgar J. Friendly. Thank you for the 21 months. Pasta socks. Thank you very much. I kind of wish Crystallize was level up because I really like having a Houndmaster. I can bring Raze. Uh, I think Raze would be pretty nice here. Probably want to get rid of Target Whistle and just use Hound's Harry. Hey, you. Ooh, thank you. Pretty pretty. I like the idea of bringing Rays. Uh, Lemon, thank you for the 19 months. Thank you, Lemon. Yeah, Bleed. I, I fought this boss. I fought this boss before. Um, I don't know if Poison. Oh, I didn't. I, I didn't realize Udichi. I don't know if Poison works on on this thing. I did not realize Udichi had uh, syphilis. Let's go cure Udichi's syphilis while we're at it. My time to shine. I just, I, you survived on the, uh, you were very good against the gibbering prophet. I'm not sure who else to bring. Saxman. No, I haven't beat a shambler yet. I fought one once. I just like, whenever I go to a Shambler, like I, I'm never ready for it. I feel like you kind of have to build around it to do it. I definitely need something to do damage up front. Uh, aside from the abomination, because I don't think I want to, I don't think I want to transform like literally every time. Does the torch mean they've been to the darkest dungeon? Yes, it means they've been to the darkest dungeon. They will never go back to the darkest dungeon. Uh, yeah, could bring Saxman. Is that my only, uh, what about, where's Zazu at? Isn't Zazu? Oh, all my, all these guys are level, are leveled up. I may as well take Saxman. Is Saxman still... Holy Slayer, Warren's Explorer. We're going to Warren's, are we not? What does Zazu have? Slugger, Warren's Tactician. I mean, Zazu makes more sense here. I need to level up Zazu a bit. And uh, Healer, I guess. Uh, uh, Ag, thank you for the 12 months. Thank you, Ag. Somebody who can heal. Probably my last. I have a level four. Probably Big Badger. Uh, not the best. I don't know how much sense this whole squad makes. I don't know how much sense this squad makes overall. But I mean, I feel like most squads just... Most things just work. Most things. We'll level this up. Level up Iron Swan get if it bleeds uh this could theoretically work i guess uh doesn't orator have a move that's like it forwards him one i think bleed out uh this oh so this is like um it debuffs you but it causes a ton of bleed interesting well might be a good idea all right uh, we'll level up Orator's bullshit. Yeah, what is it? It's like slam. Yeah, it's slam. This moves him forward one. Theoretically, having slam and the halberd move back and forward would be pretty nice. Theoretically. Come on and slam. Right, the halberd move debuffs. Yeah, I, I know. I think Zazu needs the last tier of weaponry. So does Orator. Uh, raise and... Okay, so I guess we're good to go. 
Uh, let's go check out my trinkets here. Unequip all of our trinkets, sort by class. Uh, let's see. We've got some pretty fucking good trinkets at this point. Maybe giving, uh, I definitely like 15 dodge. I like stacking dodge on, on my front liner. Feels pretty good. This is more stun resistance and dodge. Something that did something that did more damage would be nice. Hmm. Let the boys be boys. See what level? The, yeah, I, I know. I know. I can see that. You having fun with the cat? Oh, he looks so pretty. All right. Be safe. Drive careful. I love you too. Legendary Bracer, um, maybe plus 20% damage. Yeah, that is pretty nice. That is a really good item. Ancestor's pen is also pretty nice. Ancestor's pen. Tell you what, we'll give her the legendary bracer. Let's go to Orator. We're gonna give Orator the uh let's see, transform, less stress, 50% protection, virtue chance. We'll give him the uh less stress when he transforms. And we'll give him the pen, I think. Give him the pen. And uh let's see, what do we have for you? So what's funny is that I think a lot of the hound, I'm, I'm not sure, but I think a lot of these attacks from the hound are considered ranged. So if you give the hound master like the pistol, <laughs> I think, I think that actually works. So I think I could give him this. So this fuseman's matchstick actually works. So he's, he's firing his guns, his dogs out of a gun. <laughs> Uh, with this positioning, I'm not going to be able to stun because if you want to stun, you have to be in the front too. Yeah. So I guess we're not going to be trying to stun very much. I guess the good news is that we have the, the manacles though. Well, maybe I want to put Orator back here then so we could get double stun. Maybe that's what I want to do. Maybe that's what we want. Check the hound skills. Yeah. What about it? Uh, we're not really marking stuff, so we can go put this on. And uh, we can't really use that in position two either. So I guess we could do guard and ally and stack dodge. Hmm. Yeah, I don't think we're going to be able to stun the boss. Probably before we go to the boss, we're probably going to want to change stuff a little bit. But obviously this is, you know. This will help us get there. We might face we might face some real fucking bullshit on the way there. Uh, let's give my vestal uh, this, and then twenty percent HP. I feel like that's hard to turn down. And I think we are good to go. All right, I think we're good to go. Let's do it. All right, Warren's the last boss. Last boss we have to do. Yeah, Aura's been alive the entire time. He has been alive the entire time. Oh, is everything free? Oh my god, everything is free. Oh, hang on. That, that's supposed to be the, that's the town event, huh? I want to prevent a nighttime ambush. Is what I want. Prevents nighttime ambush. Yeah, I really want that. Scouting chance, encourage out of everything I want. Uh, I would also like uh, battle trance, sharpened spear. Those are pretty good. I think prey is pretty good. A little eat prey love action going on. And what does orator have? Plus four speed, that's pretty good. Light resistance plus 20% stress. Okay, I think we're good. 
it happened. We tried to kill off Aura. I mean, I, I don't. I, I want to succeed and, and do well in the game. I'm not trying to kill characters. All right, let's try again here. I guess I may as well take full stacks of food. And we'll take two full stacks of this. Take full stacks of that. Full stacks of that. And full stacks of holy water. I could get poisoned. So let's take a full stack of this. And we'll take a full stack of this. Why not? Everything's free. All right, let's go. Last boss. The spasmodically squirming, braying, and snorting half corpses were heaped each upon the yeah, other. Yeah, this is until the. I was rid of them. This is the last. The Morans had become a landfill. Uh, boss before the final darkest dungeon mission. And bone, a mountainous, twitching mass of misshapen flesh, fusing itself together in the darkness. Let's do it. The thing is more terrible than I can describe. An incoherent jumble of organ, sinew, and bone. Bone. Sure. Um. I think we're good. Um. I think we are good. All right. Let's see. Where are we going? Oh, it's got to be bottom left, don't you think? I feel like it's got to be bottom left. Name a better game narrator. Yeah, I don't know, man. He's pretty good. <laughs> Former Darkest Dungeon, I think Smoke Alok started a new run. I might start off. I might start up a new run uh, uh, fairly soon. I may start one up fairly soon. You're supposed to dodge. Uh, phony people, thank you for the tier two 46 months. Thank you very much. Yep. Oh, you're dead. Wasn't sure. Uh, let's try to stun you. New run right after the Hades grind. I hate. I hate. Why would I grind Hades right now? I do kind of miss Hades a little bit, but yeah, I would definitely. If I played again, I would definitely turn on. I would definitely get all the DLC for sure. When I first bought this game, I didn't know if I was gonna like like it at all. I had no idea. No idea if I was even gonna like the game. Don't enable musketeer. Why not? This game is awesome. It actively makes the game worse. Why? Why is that? Musketeers are useless. I didn't like this game until I played it. Sometimes when you when sometimes watching somebody play a game. It can be, um, it can be hard to tell what's going on. When I have seen people, play, when I had seen people play this game before, I didn't know what I was even looking at. And a lot of people have, um, a lot of, a lot of the streamers, I like, I saw Smoke Alok play it, and Smoke Alok isn't exactly explaining everything that's going on the entire time, so it's like kind of hard. Sometimes it's a little hard to follow, you know. Size alone. That's case with Hades too. Well, with Hades, there's so much visual confusion all the time, and you know when you get when you get at some point when you get good enough of the game, you don't necessarily want to stop and explain it every 15 seconds. Like I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna sit down and explain what heat what Hades heat is every time I sit down to do a run. So, and I I totally understand that. Okay, so uh, we're gonna we're making a fucking beeline for this boss. Pretty nice. Oh, um, excuse me, Barber King. What is heat again? I'm not going to do that. Yeah, sometimes in Hades, I just kind of say, like, I don't know what's going on. <laughs> I just press the buttons and hope something happens. Well, we may as well camp. Um, 
really no reason not to. Let's go and take this off. And we'll put this on. And I think, what about Orator? I think he's good. All right, let's go ahead and camp. A spark without kindling is a goal without hope. Okay, so this is uh, plus 25% damage for four battles, and this this will stress out everybody. <laughs> the quickening is four speed for battles. That's pretty good. Let's do this to prevent nighttime ambush. Um, let's do this to give him more speed, I guess. Yeah. A little bit more speed and let's do this for uh more cr i like i like crit i like crit crit good i don't have enough for psych up we can encourage her and we're good the light the promise of safety all gas no brakes am i gonna play the dlc or well, right now i'd like to finish this run after i finish this run uh then we'll see what i do one thing at a time. Unnerved, unbalanced. Wow. That is a lot of fucking damage all of a sudden. Uh, let's guard her. Let's protect her or she fucking croaks. Huh? Rip all gas, no brakes. Up oh, more syphilis, great. What does syphilis do? I can't remember. Oh my god, that's so bad, man. Fuck you, that's so bad. God, it's so annoying. A devastating. Like, what was I supposed to do? Oh, well. All right, so this thing is dead. What a wonderful game this is. Death by Too bad penicillin is an item you carry. Is penicillin something you... Can you even use penicillin against syphilis? <laughs> no, be, I should have used the blight against him. A lot of syphilis experts in here in chat today. This is I roll the game, yeah. The abyss returns even the boldest gaze. Boy, these en these enemies are these insatiable ghouls. They are something else, man. They are something else. Are you dead? Yeah, you're dead. A momentary abatement. Not having sex helps. The scars on Aura's head look like an A. Alright, let me take a look at my abilities here. So we've got Hound's Harry. Um... Okay, so we can also slam from here. Okay, I think we should be okay. Okay. As the light gains purchase. All right, let's get in here. Spirits are lifted. And purpose A for clear. America. Squirming. Ooh, that's kind of bad. All right, let's see. What does this thing do anyway? This so it actually doesn't resist. Some, some parts resist blight, and some some don't. Some parts also, it looks like you can kind of stun this part too. All right, uh, let's go ahead and transform. And uh, I guess let's use slam. What a, what a beautiful game. What a beautiful game. 
What a beautiful, beautiful game this is. Uh, all right. Nice. I guess let's just do that. Um, this game can be a little hit and miss. All the bleed is pretty nice. So rake lasts for three rounds. Okay. Oh yeah, I should use a dog treat. Yeah, using using Hound's Harry is is so good in this fight. It really is. I feel like in some fights in this game, there's like, there's like a move you want to do. And like that move makes the fight so much easier. Especially with the bonus accuracy. The wounds of war yeah, I'm playing on just normal difficulty. But never hidden. No, I guess just more bleed. You know, I, I probably, you know what? I probably shouldn't have hit the head. I probably shouldn't have hit the head. These things are all massively resistant to uh, everything. Great. Ow, man. God. Precision and power. Three hound masters. Three hound masters with three hair. Three hounds Harry's. That would be a lot. I should have used an anti venom on him. I could Iron Swan here. Let's do this. Penis. Why are you fighting baby back ribs? Because I want my baby back, baby back, baby back, baby back ribs. Duh. Uh, yeah, they have a 60% resistance to blight. So like Houndmaster plus blight grenade would be pretty good, I think, in this fight. The oh. ground quakes. Damn. Leave him alone, man. Leave him alone. Leave Brittany alone. Go. So we're going to single him out because that's what the fucking AI in this game does. We single him out. That is all we fucking do in this game is single out the one character. That's what this game does. Hold fast or expire. Jesus fucking Christ. Teetering on the brink, facing the abyss. Uh, 
Oh, that's right. I have bandages. Boy, this boss is no joke, man. These crits everywhere. This is no joke. I think it's dead. I know. Some of these moves, man. Uh, yeah, I think you're pretty dead. There we, small there we go. There we go. Man! Of its terrible existence. That was a lot of crits. Those 33 crits and shit, man. Seize this GG. Push on some big, we got hit end. by some big fucking crits in that one. I know. Double 33 crit. Alright. We got a nice item, too. Let's see. Orator. We know Orator got syphilis. Um... Necromania and Zazu. That's pretty good. That's bad, but Hard Noggin is nice. Full stacks of every item and didn't use a single one. But each help the other, and in so doing, help okay. themselves. Uh, well, so that means we have done every single thing on our list here. Every boss has been beaten. The only thing left to do is do the final Darkest Dungeon quest. That's the only thing left to do. Um, syphilis is pretty bad for a, a melee character. Uh, let's see. Yeah, I guess the only thing I didn't do is get an, an antiquarian. <laughs> That's like the only thing I didn't do. Let's go drop off Big Badger. Did Ray's pick up something I don't want? Clumsy is bad. I guess let's go get rid of Clumsy on Ray's. I have no idea what... To, so, in the last Darkest Dungeon mission, I have no idea what to expect. Um, yeah, I have no idea. Do that. Um, so, I guess I'll just heal these characters in the event that I have to use them. None of these characters with the torch next to their name are... Um, none of these characters with the torch next to their name, I can't take any of them in. So they're all out. So that means characters I can potentially take in are Dan, Python, Saxman, Efferday, Blackjack, Tofu, Hammerwolf, uh, Udichi. Big Badger's level five. I have a bunch of level threes and fours. I could level them up a little bit, but I don't really have that many characters to take in. I don't really have a crazy amount. Uh, let's go level. Blackjack, I think, came back from the dead, if I'm not mistaken. Came back from the dead, you have to level them all up again. I'm pretty sure that the fi whatever this is, I'm pretty sure that this has to be a final boss. I'm pretty sure it has to just be a boss. Um, let's go level everything up. probably sell some stuff um all right so he's now fully leveled up what does derived functor have uh i guess we can go ahead and let's get rid of that on derived functor as well we may need him weak grip is pretty bad but for now let's just get rid of hemophilia so all right let's take a look here it says it's short there's no camping I feel like you're just going to go directly into a boss, is what I feel like. I feel like you're just going to go directly into a boss. Go on a money run? I've got so many trinkets. If I want money, I can just sell some of these. <laughs> I've got so many. I don't even need... I don't need this. And, uh... I don't know if I need three Vestal Scrolls. I definitely don't need antiquarian items, like, at all. I don't need those. And I think we're good. So, yeah, we got plenty of money now. So, who do we want to bring in? Okay, so he, I definitely... All right, here's here's my thought. I have Zaz, Zazu is... Uh, we're curing Zazu. So, I feel like Saxman is... You're going in. I, if I lose Saxman, like, let's say, let's say this is... Let's assume... 
I am going to completely, totally fail this, right? If I lose, if I lose my, my Hellion, oh, guess what? I've got another Hellion right away. So whatever, right? Hellion right off the bat. I'm uh, expendable. Uh, I think I only have the one. I think I only have the one Plague Doctor. So maybe I don't want to bring that. I like Plague Doctors, but uh, maybe if it's the only one I have, you know? I think Blackjack is pretty expendable here. Hammerwolf is my only bounty hunter. So I don't think I want to do that. I have another Vestal. Yeah, you always need another Vestal. So I don't really know who my last, who my, my second person is here. A cultist. A cultist could give me potentially double healing. I already have, I already have a Vestal. I just feel like whatever we want to hit, like my damage would not be great. So. A fitting team name would be the expendables i'm operating from the 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 idea that all of these characters are going to die i'm operating from that i don't know if i believe that i just i'm operating from the point of view that all of these characters are probably going to die i only have so at this point i feel like i have to make a choice i feel like if i bring python or tofu I feel like my damage will not be great. That's what I feel like. When I bring Python or Tofu, I feel like I'm not gonna have great damage. Throw me in and let me be a martyr. Well, it does make sense if I'm if I'm thinking about it from who is expendable. I think Python or like I have two level six occultists. They're pretty fucking expendable, don't you think? I've got two of them. So really, this is like a nothing really venture thing. The only thing that's kind of inconvenient is if I kill Blackjack. Um, if I kill Blackjack, that kind of sucks because he's my only level six. Well, I don't even know if I can stun. I don't know if this is like the worst. I don't know if this is the worst party. Keep your vessel for the real attempt. Well, all right. So I have uh, this is Efferday, who's never been in. I've also got Big Badger. So I have I have a spare one. He's not level six, but I have a spare occult, uh, a spare one. It's not that much. This is a weird party. I mean, no shit. I mean, I can't take all these other characters in. The only, uh, my only other thing I could switch in would either be Dan the VP. That's or Hammerwolf, I guess. I'm, I'm saving. I, I, I feel like I could throw in Dan. I could throw in Dan here. Motherfucker, don't tell me to not bring a healer because if you don't bring a healer, this game will fucking murder you. All right, don't fucking tell me to not bring a healer. A cultist, a cultist healing is not reliable. Don't fucking tell me to not bring a healer, all right? You need a fucking healer. Well, I feel like the reason why I don't want to use Hammerwolf is that I feel like I want to save... I, I Again, I am operating from the point of view that I am about to die and the next attempt will be the real attempt when I know what's happening, right? So Hammerwolf is a really good character and he's my only level six bounty hunter. I don't have another bounty hunter, so I don't want to throw him in, you know? So like the net, yeah, this is a recon mission. We're going to try our best, but it's a recon mission. Exactly. This party looks okay with that in mind. Right, so like, I'm not really risking much by risking any of these characters is the point. I'm sending in the red shirts. I think that's my best strat. That's my best chance going forward. Cause like, let's say like, 
let's say I find out that Marked is really good here. Let's say I find out, oh my God, Marked is super good. Well, if I lost Hammerwolf, then all of a sudden I don't have Marked as an option, you know? I'm like, oh, well, well, now I have to level up a bounty hunter or something, you know, like if I do this, I'm really, everything I'm losing here is like, ah, well, I, that's okay. I've got another Hellion. I've got another, I've got another Vestal. I've got another this one. The only thing that kind of sucks is losing this is be losing my Crusader, but I'm not really sure how much the Crusader is actually going to help. I'm going with this. This is what I'm going with. And we'll find out how this is going to work out. Uh, everybody is fully leveled up. Let's uh, unequip all of these. Let's sort all these out. And we'll see. I don't know what to expect at all. So I have no idea what I'm going into. Um, it's short. So maybe just a boss fight. I feel like it would be pretty shitty if the game was like... Hey, you know how you just did the most grueling dungeon ever? Here's another super grueling dungeon. I feel like that would be pretty shitty. Stun resist. Bleed resist. There'd be a lot of resistances on this first character. Are you already losing the trinkets here? I understand that I would be losing these trinkets. I understand. I don't think this would help me. I'm not sure if bleed is really a factor. 15% more HP is pretty nice. Let's give you that. Let's give you that big dodge there. Plus eight dodge. The occultist is the one where I'm like, I don't know how to fucking use you here. <laughs> I don't know how to fucking use you. Uh, plus stun skill chance, plus debuff skill chance, minus 10% virtue, plus 15% stress. This might actually be not bad. This might actually be not bad. Might be not bad. Well, it's plus, it's minus some virtue chance. Like, whatever. Need to equip the D. Right, I'd have to, I'd have to equip it. Let's see, what, what attacks do I have equipped with you? This doesn't make a lot of sense the way it is. Only this makes a ton of sense. Whatever. Chat treating Barb like he sucks at games. I mean, I don't know. Like, the thing that's going to make me suck at this is not knowing what I'm going into. And there's no way to know what I'm going into until I know what I'm going into. You know what I'm saying? For all I know, I'm going into a boss that can't be fucking stunned. Holy Lance is great, but, um... Mm. Debuff skill, move chance, 10% HP. Damage versus unholy. I don't know if it's unholy. All right, let's give him this. We're gonna give you this. Bleed resistance. I do not know if it's unholy or not. I have no idea. Cleansing crystal is pretty nice. Could be a lot of status effect. You're, we're not going to be doing a lot of, uh, we're not going to be doing any bleed or, or, all right, we'll try that. And I'm also not risking much by doing that. Oh, uh, 10% HP is not bad. Plus 10% damage to melee skills. That's also not bad. Let's give him the... Where's the legendary bracer at? That's what I want to give you. He's going to have really shit speed, though. I mean, I don't know. I don't know, man. Blackjack the zombie. 
I don't know. I feel like this is okay, but I don't know. Go last, swing hard. I don't know. No idea. Is it time? All right, we'll start a bet. Start a prediction of Will, Barb. Uh, ca characters dying doesn't matter. So uh, Will, Barb uh, win the mission. Will I complete the mission? I have to kill the Heart of Darkness. Characters dying doesn't matter. Uh, will I complete the mission? Let you guys place your bets. Good luck. Thank you. Will I complete the mission? Darkest Dungeon Quest, not all heroes are guaranteed to survive. Must Someone must sacrifice themselves to hold off. Am I excited? Yeah, I mean, it's, it's always cool to go into something and not know what you're getting yourself into. For sure. <sighs> Who even knows, dude? Let's bring let's bring as much as we can here. Poison. I don't know if I need food. It says it's short. <laughs> Who even knows, dude? Who even knows? This is the final one. Can we bet on this? The bet is up, moron. You can bet right now, you idiot. Jesus. Let's give it a try. The bet is up. Oh, can we bet? Can we bet? Yeah, I mean, may as well fucking try laudanum, right? I don't know if it's gonna be worth a damn. The, the bet is already fucking up. Who knows? Very well could be going to my death. Very, very well. Use your eyes for once. You got this. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know what I'm getting myself into. I've, I've, but, but the good news is that I have literally like tried to like make this. I'm not risking that much with this party. I'm not risking that much with this party. So that is the idea. That is the idea. Yeah, I'll bring a shovel just in case. I'm not really miss. I, I'm not risking that much. So. Right. I need the info. I need the info for what I'm even getting myself into. If we lose, we lose. I'm not going to be that upset if we lose. So. All right. Dot, dot, dot. Can we give tips? Yeah, the donation tab is beneath the stream, motherfucker. Tip away, bitch. Uh, well, it's a long hallway. I think it'll be fights on the way. Oh. Uh, ancestor. Listen. In all my terrible researches, what I sought was a glimpse behind the veil, a crumb of cosmic truth. I found it here, and in that moment of brain-blasting realization, I ceased to be a man and became a herald, an avatar of the crawling chaos. We get some uh, some hot lore as we go through the here. You enjoy the lore. It's uh, it's pretty well written. Oh, we're we're gaining stress just by walking. <laughs> life feeds on life. In your petty pursuit of family redemption, you consume those who rally to your cause, and in so doing, you strengthen the thing, accelerating the end. This is as it should be. It is why you are here. Can you use a shovel to get past him? <laughs> I guess we're I guess we're gonna fight the 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 I guess we're gonna fight him. Uh DBL tapped. Thank you for the Twitch Prime. Can we escape? I don't think so. We are chained here forever, you and I, at the end of the world. Free yourself, rouse the thing, and embrace the ineffable cosmic hideousness that lives within us all. Okay. Harold's getting dramatic. What am I even fighting for? 
Dude, I'm I'm definitely gonna die. <laughs> definitely gonna die here. You still foolishly uh, consider yourself an entity ancestor. Five. Oh, he's only got five I HP. It should be easy. Better. And I will show you. So only one. Okay, so. It looks like these three are fakes, and then this one's the real one. So that they're relatively weak, they're relatively weak to everything. Like they can be stunned. Uh, they can, a lot of stuff can happen to them. Try this. Okay, stunned him. Try to stun him too. Okay, I don't know what's gonna happen here, but let's try iron swanning him. I don't think this is gonna, I don't think this, this is definitely not gonna kill him. I know it's not gonna kill him. It's not gonna be this easy. Okay, figured. Now I know. <laughs> that makes sense. Reunion. Oh, that's not good. So they're eldritch and human. So maybe after you kill all of them, then you can hit the final one. They're gonna be strong. This guy's dead already, unless unless something fucking happens. I don't know. Another heal. Well, it's not doing a ton of damage to me. A lot of stress. Reunion. Oh, no, I thought maybe that spread the uh, bleed to me. Sure. I really want to make sure I want to see what I want to make sure that guy dies in case this fucker heals him again. I want to make sure he dies. Uh, we will stunning blow this guy. So it seems like the game's like, yeah, stun him, blight him, bleed him, whatever you want to do. So I haven't, I don't understand the gimmick yet. Like, I don't know what what is it I have to do? So is there's perfect reflections and there's ancestors. So I don't know what the game wants me to do yet. I haven't figured it out. This is like a puzzle. I feel like why is this one's a little bit taller? Why is this one a little bit taller? Kill them all in the same time. I don't know. That seems kind of bullshit. I'm wondering why this one is taller. You can't stun the ancestor either. Maybe I should try attacking him again. I don't, there's no way though. There's no way. Mm. 
What the fuck? So this is an imperfect reflection. Maybe he eventually like can't make more copies of himself. So maybe, maybe what I'm doing is the right thing. Maybe I'm doing the right thing. Oh, shout outs to never using bandages, by the way. <laughs> Let me load up on all my bandages, bro. Still not using stuff. This one is even weaker to stuff. It's like weaker than the other one is. Maybe it's weaker. Yeah. All right, let's try stunning you. Yeah, I don't, I don't know yet. I'm just trying to figure out what I need to do here. So I'm not sure. So maybe it's like a chance. Sometimes it's perfect. Sometimes it's not. It's definitely interesting that this is like a puzzle. What happens if you do kill them all at the same time? Like, is that even possible? Stun you. are the same I feel like I'm just waiting I'm waiting for something because like he's not he's not really doing that much damage to me most of the damage he's he's doing is most of the damage he's doing is to my my stress so I'm waiting for the other shoe to drop I'm like waiting for something to happen Perfect. Yeah, I'm waiting for something to happen. This is, this is, this is, this doesn't seem right so far. Never saw it chooses that marked my character. Just on you. Imperfect reflection. I don't know, man. I don't know. I wonder if I should have tried if I should try attacking him again. Probably not. We're going to keep hacking these guys down. They all stunned. <laughs> They're all stunned. Oh, we did it. We did a damage. So like, what does it just keep killing these guys then? We did one damage to them. We did a damage. So I guess just keep killing these guys. Keep killing these guys then maybe. No sense going after the stunned guy because he's not going to do anything this turn. 
Uh, okay. It's not this easy. No, I don't know. Maybe after I, maybe after he comes back. Maybe when he comes back, it's going to be something else. Like, I'm just waiting for something else to happen here. Something else is going to happen. Phase two, yeah. I'm not buying it. It's not this simple. There's no way that this boss is all about doing like a few damage at a time like this. I'm not fucking buying it. Hmm? Alright, it's done here. You haven't seen where is the heart of darkness, right? I haven't seen a heart of darkness yet. Yeah, dude, I don't know. I'm not buying this shit. I'm not buying it. What's going to happen? Oh, fuck you. <laughs> You missed the narration. Well, the, the amount of stuns, ha the stuns have really paid off. A lot of stuns everywhere have really been good. Isn't this the one I have to kill here? Well, he's at zero HP. Now what? The flesh is fluid. It can be changed, reshaped. Absolute remade. nothingness. Well, there's no way we're hacking through that. 990. It resists everything. And he's got. Okay, so this is the real boss then. This is it then. Phase two. Looks like he can be stunned. Can't reach him. So if this is the way... So, okay. If this is the way the fight is, if this is, like, the real boss, I don't know if it's going to move around at all, but if it's like this, then I feel like I'm going to need a somebody who can either pull, who can bring him forward, or I'm going to need characters that can hit the back line. And I don't I'm on both on both counts I'm kind of fucked right now. On both counts I'm kind of fucked. I've got Iron Swan. Did I I literally can't even do anything with my I guess I could um Does uh Holy Lance Holy Lance does hit the back. Sure. He's got to get a running start. Oh. 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 It seems like he kind of moves around. All right. Oh, uh, we could try to stun him. He's human Eldritch. I didn't know if he was going to stay back there like the prophet or not. We'll try to stun. Nice. Yeah, there's a lot of stress for sure. Great. <laughs> uh, oh, you know, go ahead and de stress yourself a little bit there, buddy. Okay. 
keep hacking at him. We're not gonna stun him. Nice crits. Can't holy lance him. I've had a lot of crits versus him. If I vault, he's got nine. Oh, I thought that said 999 dodge. I was like, wait, what? <laughs> All right, let's try to stun him again, I guess. Take a chance to stun him. Okay. Well, it kind of sucks. I kept, I keep waiting for him to go back. I keep waiting for him to go backwards, but he's not doing it. Maybe there's another phase after this. Maybe there's another phase. Yeah, the occultist has been pretty good. Can't lie. Unmake them all. So we've seen that attack. Look, I've got, look, look at me guys. I use the bandage. <laughs> uh, all right. That didn't do a lot of damage. Let's go ahead and try to stun. Another stun. Cause he's an Eldritch, it's done a lot more damage. I could try to make him bleed. He does kind of resist bleed. Nah, just keep hacking at him. He's... We'll keep hacking and whacking and schmacking. We'll heal the party a little bit. Well, we're not going to stun him this time. Sacrificial stab move having that much range has been pretty nice. Why do you keep bleeding? Stop bleeding. Uh, try to stun. Nope. All right. I can't hit him with the wicked hack, so let's hit him with the if it bleeds. Zero HP. Okay, you have zero HP. The flesh is immortal. Oh, is this it, it is now? Dying. Pray so here's the finally here's the heart of darkness, right? Form. Fuck. God, that takes a long time just to get here, dude. Oh man. I could try Adrenaline Rush to heal, gain some damage and accuracy. Looks like it can bleed. It says, oh, it says Gestating Heart. Oh, I thought that said Heart of Darkness. I mean, it's going to be alive for a while. In the end, if it's alive for a while, I feel like uh, bleeding it is going to cause more damage overall. So let's try it.
I can stun it. Guess let's try it. Am I gaining? How am I gaining life? How am I gaining life? I don't know. Just Eldritch. Uh, just poison me somehow. Okay, we're poisoned. Sure. Yeah, I it's gestating, so that means is something gonna burst out of this? <laughs> like, what is gonna happen here? Does it even do anything? I don't know, man. Yeah, it's poisoning me a lot. It's resistant versus stuns right now. So any attack I do on it, any attack I do on it is poisoning me, poisoning me. Uh, this is a hell of a lot of poison. Maybe I should have tried to stun it. Well, I mean, I don't know. I don't know, man. I guess I could use holy waters now. Why not? Sure. Holy water. It's got 18 HP left and it's going to take 12 damage here. I don't know what's going to happen here. I still don't know what's going to happen here. This is like the longest fucking thing ever. Holy shit. <laughs> does, this, does this ever end? All right, now it's a harder time. This is the longest fucking thing ever, man. Holy crap. Yeah. It does bleed. It's got eight bleed right now. Come unto your maker. Am I choosing who's gonna die? <laughs> no! Am I choosing who dies? So this thing... Cosmic. Mm, I have to choose who dies. Oh, well, I just wanted to look at his trinkets. Oh, I guess I chose. I actually just wanted to look at his trinkets. <laughs> uh, I guess you can stun this thing. It says, yeah, looks like you can stun it. So that is an instant death. Shit is gnarly. Taking four damage.
Why can't I? Oh, I guess it just it only lasts for one turn or something. Try to stun. It's got a decent chance of stunning. It's like a 50-50. Yeah. Eventually that wasn't going to work. like every couple of turns I can't be the hellion the hellion's the only thing doing damage that's 61 HP left it's too horrible no uh, I'm sorry I'm sorry, Efferday. You know, Efr wasn't Efferday a kleptomaniac? <laughs> Weren't you a kleptomaniac for a while? Stun him. Let's go! Ah! Victory. GG. A hollow and ridiculous notion. Well done. No I don't think that figure that thing mattered at all. It. <laughs> and we will be returned to GG. in time. The great family of man a profusion of errant flesh multiplying swarming living dying until the stars align in their inexorable formation and what sleeps is roused once more to hatch from this fragile shell of earth and rock and bring our inescapable end so seek solace in a manner befitting your lineage and take up your mugatory vigil haunted forever by that sickening prose echoing through the infinite blackness of space and time ruin has come to our family GG. Invited the smash. <laughs> All right. GG. Hey! Darkest dungeon beaten. Darkest dungeon beaten. It was an honor again. So. The blackjack died twice for me. GG. What a game. Hey! Managed to win Darkest Dungeon. We beat the game today. Oh, man. What a game. What a game. Uh. Irritant Rash, thank you for the two months. All the decadent uh, I have seen. Thank you very much. Blackjack, thank you for the bits. Final Jeb's Beard, thank you for the tier 3 24 months. Thank you very look, much. Nor could I look away. So I guess there's nothing. We've done everything. We've literally done everything. You can keep playing, I guess, but we've done... The only thing I didn't do is get an Antiquarian to level 6. <laughs> that was the only thing I didn't do. 
Oh, yeah, we didn't kill a Shambler as well. Never, I never did that. Uh, Play-Doh Warrior. Thank you for the 10 gift subs. Thank you, Play-Doh Warrior. Uh, but yeah, man, fantastic game. Had a ton of fun. Uh, I definitely, definitely will be playing again. Maybe even very soon. And uh, I think the next time we do it, we will buy all the DLC and have all the DLC content and we'll do it all. What happened to APOC? Uh, did APOC die? What did happen to APOC? What did happen to APOC? Did he just leave? I thought, I, didn't I have a second bounty hunter? Sort by class. Yeah, what did happen to APOC? Oh, he's right there. I did have a second. Yeah, yeah, he's right there. You died. Uh, Joe Rawls, thank you for the 1,000 bits. Thank you very much. Hey, but I had a ton of fun. Really, really like Darkest Dungeon. It's the best Pokemon game I've ever played. Uh, really, really fun. Let's take a look at the graveyard. Sure, man. Here's our graveyard. Uh, these are some of the early characters when I was still figuring out what the fuck I was doing in the game. And uh, Tesseract, MFK, Drumbum, Jim McCrud, Uza, Silvice, Barb Toxic, Ben Squint, Peepo Juice, Athena, uh, Eduardo, Joe Rawls, uh, Efferday, and Blackjack. Yeah, I think the. I, I don't know. I don't know if there's a way to. I don't know how the last fight works in this game at all. I guess there's just no way to stop your characters from dying, right? I guess there's just no way. So I like you pour one out for the homies. Pour one out for the homies. That's how it is. You can dodge it. Like if you just super stack up dodge. Only way you can do it is, is death blows. You can kill it with one hit. You can keep from dying if you only go. It only happens if you have more than two alive. Oh, okay. Killed by a vile Wilbur. Wilbur was net. It was uh it was the the swine god put him on death on the death thing. And then uh, Wilbur hits him. That's how it goes. So that's what happened to uh, Eduardo there. But yeah, GG, man. Uh, what a game. We'll definitely be playing again with all of the DLC, uh, probably the near future. Uh, was a lot of fun. Definitely, um, I would say that overall, my favorite classes would probably be the Houndmaster for sure. The Bounty. I think the Houndmaster might be my favorite. Um, I really like the Bounty Hunter. Uh, I really like the Highwayman. Uh, many tapestries. We have many tapestries. Thank you for the 10 gift subs. Thank you, many tapestries. Holy crap. I appreciate that. Thank you very much. Uh, if you got a gift sub, welcome. Thank you very much. And, uh, Bastel Bro, thank you for the 40 months. Thank you very much. Uh, I like the Hellion for sure. I like the Hellion for sure. Definitely like it. Pay out the bet. All right, let's pay the bet. We got to pay the people. Will Barb win the mission? The answer was yes, we succeeded. I didn't fail a single Darkest Dungeon mission. Uh, I just must be extremely good at this game. I must be amazing at this game. That's the only thing I can possibly conclude. You killed all your Crusaders. Ah, uh, that's true. I did have a lot of Crusaders and Arbalesters die. I did have a lot. Yeah, I didn't kill a Shambler. There's no way to go like seek out a Shambler, I guess. I guess maybe you run around without a torch and you can go kill a shambler. Probably the way to do that, but yeah, a lot of fun. GG. All right, I'll play more Darkest Dungeon in the future. We'll probably start a fresh run at some point. Um, but for now, we're saying GG.